Um, so let's talk about tonight. How long are these gusty winds going to last? We're still expecting sustained wind speeds between 20 and 30. Peak gusts are going to be right around 45 for most of the valley. I think some spots could still approach the 50 mile per hour mark, but by and large, it's going to be closer to 45. That'll take us all the way through 7 o'clock. After that, we're going to see a steep drop in wind speeds. Now, pollen levels, of course, are still going to be high in the next several days, but there's an improvement. They had been between 10 and 11 and take a look. We're down into the nine. So again, still quite high. You still want to keep the meds handy, uh, but it is looking a little bit better out there as the weeks go by. Satellite radar composite there very clearly is our system and you can see the cool front starting to make its way closer to the Las Vegas Valley. In fact, as we take a look at 13 first alert desert Doppler, we are tracking just a bit of activity, mainly on Mount Charleston, just a smidge uh, up toward the northern mountains. However, if you take a look at the valley, of course, everything is looking quiet. We don't expect these storms to make their way into the valley. They're just very, very high up in elevation. There's a five o'clock hour, not expecting a change. We do see a little blip come up uh, in the southwest mountains right around 630, but as we move through the rest of the evening, everything just clears out. There's 1015 and we don't expect any activity for the rest of the evening. So once the cloud cover left, we gained all that heat we had lost yesterday. Uh, 77 degrees warmer than at this time yesterday. 84 degrees out there. Take a look at the gusts though at McCarran. 36 mile per hour gusts and in Henderson. We talked about this a little earlier, quite stronger, closer to 50. That's the strongest gust we've seen so far today in the Las Vegas Valley. And even the sustained wind speeds are quite strong at 38 miles per hour. So for tonight, another mild night, 62 degrees for central portions of the valley, closer to 60 in Anthem, uh, 61 Sunrise Manor, and tomorrow will be another nice warm day in the mid 80s, but definitely not as windy as we saw for today. And we are still tracking quite the warm up as we head into the weekend, close to 90 on Saturday, and we break uh, that threshold on Sunday. We will be in the low 90s on Sunday, Monday. We have a couple of days of breezy winds to deal with on Thursday and on Friday with the system. Uh, but then we have our next one coming in late into the weekend, not really affecting temperatures too much, however. Carla?